You little leader and little mom or whoever you are, those arguing. Um, the other day you said you didn't care, you all said you didn't care because they were just clones. They were people who were just clones. Now you guys say, uh, you ladies say, well, you did it to prove who, who owned it, who was property. What? Yeah, what? Is it a clone or isn't it a clone? The little leader, the, the Quinn Wong clone over there or whatever, right? Uh, you, one minute you care, no, one minute you don't care, leader. You sound more and more like a drug addict neurotic than anything because you're still not consistent with your with your mode of conversation there. Or, you know, Bernard or, or Harry. You sound like a fucking idiot. So you still, you try, still not just trying to make your little porn shop or something shit? With all these dead people. How many dead people you guys got over there? How many dead people did David make? <laughs> but actually, probably what you guys are seeing is... Uh, the remnants of some of the families that he fucked over that are coming out just as the gangs moved into the cities and see you guys are actually watching those families like do their routine because they saw some of the stuff and then they're slowly dying out because they're being replaced well with shit and so actually the demographics would support that african americans would probably be more or less the clone um uh <laughs> as far as the nation's concerned i mean i don't have to I'd have to check my facts, but it would be more suggestive that they are. But these would be more original people. But hey, you guys, you guys have your religious thing on stem cells and doing whatever and like waste your time when some people actually had it going and working. And I think that's the major dispute is that dipshit killed the wrong kids. And you all keep fucking covering for his dumbass because he's always been a fucking pedo. And you guys much rather support that because you guys think, well, we can do whatever we want. Well, you don't live along with him. And that's why I say, I don't fight him. I just let him run it. And when you guys live there and go, live under him and you go, oh, how great he is. He's not going to give a fuck about you. He's going to let all this pride die and most of his friends die too. So you guys have fun, Lita. Because he ain't going to be your friend because they're out to get one thing and one thing only. And you'll find out what that is. And when they turn against you, don't complain.